Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to be doing a quick update on the Botanium and we'll see how it's getting on. So I'm sure you can see behind me the Botanium has been progressing nicely. Uh, we have quite a few nice leaves and we even have some flowers starting out. So you can see that the leaves are still looking really healthy. The older leaves in particular, nice deep green and uh, you can see the new growth coming through as well. And in between that new growth, you can see some flowers starting out. So just the beginning of a flower. And I'm sure they'll all start putting out flowers properly very, very soon. Down here, we can see where the root is connecting to the grow media, that everything looks okay there as well. Uh, I can see now and then if we just poke around in here, we can see some lovely white roots, which is just what you want to see. This little gadget here actually monitors the power consumption of a device. So if I just put that on, we can see at the moment, it's not drawing anything because the pump isn't running at the moment and it really uses a very minimal amount of energy. So if we just unplug this and plug it back in, I know that the pump will kick in and we can see how much power this actually draws. So if you keep an eye on that middle figure, here the pump just kicked in and it's showing there 0.12 amps, so it's 120 milliamps, which is really an insignificant amount of power. The reason I wanted to test the power consumption of this thing is because I'm running this on a light over there. We can see this LED light, which came from Botanium, which is doing a great job. In fact, most of this growth is because of this light. There is a little bit of sunlight that comes through this window later in the day, but most of the day it's just ambient light like you see at the moment here. So coming through the window, not a lot, but this light over here is doing decently. The problem is not everybody wants to run one of these LED lights for 16 hours a day like I'm doing. So when we do have lovely sunshine outside, we want to get our plant outdoors. To do that is a bit of a challenge because we need to be able to power this thing. There's a pump in here and it needs to run. But thankfully this system is running off a USB cable. So that means that we should be able to use a USB charging block like this. So most of you would have one of these and uh, you could just plug it in there. This specific one is not a good one to use because it switches itself off after it detects that there's a limited draw of power. So when I first plug this in, if we have a look here, we'll see that it will switch on like it just did and the pump will kick in. We'll see that in just a second. There you go. So the pump kicks in and once that pump switches off, it's not drawing a lot of power anymore, which is great because you're not going to run down your battery very quickly. But with chargers like this, it has a safety mechanism built in, which means that it shuts itself down if it's not detecting any power. So try and get yourself a charger that doesn't have that safety mechanism in and you should be good to go. There are a few other ways you can uh, obviously power it. You could probably get away with using a small solar powered USB charger. So give it a try. Um, I'm going to try a few experiments for my, my own purposes because I do want to take this outside. I don't want to be running it under lights all the time and we'll see how we get on. So that's it for this video. Just a quick update on how this is progressing. The Botanium is doing really well. I'm quite pleased with it actually. I did have my reservations but so far so good. Not a problem at all. I will do a couple more updates through the year just to keep you updated on the progress here. I think the next one hopefully I'll be able to show you some peppers growing on this and I'll let you know what I do with the nutrient solution. But for the moment it's doing great and uh, just wait until the end of the year when I give you my final verdict. But for now it's a thumbs up from me.